Hello, hi dear one. Yeah, I haven't seen you in a while. It's been like it's been like 11 weeks, I think. Yeah, listen, I was waiting or wondering if you don't want to come shoot your bow. What you don't? Because of COVID. Well, you know what I think. I think I'm going to shoot this phone so you never hear from me again. Okay, screw you. Welcome back guys, I'm back with another video and today uh, I, I'm going to make it a bit more interesting. I think you guys would have remembered uh, last week we did a thousand rubber bands versus an arrow. Uh, that video is close to getting a thousand likes so I'm going to put a little thingy up here, here somewhere here. Um, go check out that video. If you get a thousand likes I'm going to do two thousand rubber bands. But today on the menu we have a, a phone. Um, it doesn't work, it doesn't have a battery in or anything, so it's essentially worthless. It's been lying in my drawer for close to five years now, five, six years. So, might as well give it a shoot, see if it stops an arrow. So, uh, this thing is getting an arrow. Anyway, let's get, let's put everything up and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I died. I'm gonna go, oh. There we go. I need to keep this thing up here, I think we found a way. Oh, wait. Okay, phone's ready. Let's get all the cameras set up and I'll see you guys at 50 yards. We're gonna see if we can't edit at 50 yards with the field point first. So the first shot will be at 50. I think I can see it. Uh, it's, as you guys can see, it's way down there. And uh, I'm not gonna try even try with, uh, with the broad edge. It's especially not a big fixed blade. I don't, I'm scared I hit the camera if I do that. But um, yeah, let's see. If I can't hit this thing first go. If not, we're gonna go a bit closer. But uh, I'll do one arrow at 50, then I'll go to 20 if I can't hit it, and I'll then shoot with the broad edge. I almost hit the camera. <laughs> So um, uh, we came to come and pick, the phone didn't fall off, but I'm going to check this one out. So here is Mr. GoPro getting us some 240 frames per second slow-mo. This is the distance I missed him by. This is the phone. So I missed the phone by this much on 50. And uh, I, I threaded the needle between the camera and the phone. I don't, do you think I should try again from 50? Yes. Okay, let's have it. Okay. I think the, the, the root of our problem is the wind is coming from, well, my left to right and I shot right, right in between the camera. So I'm either going to wait for the wind to die down or just fight it a bit or just hold a bit left. But uh, let's see if I can't hit it on the second round. Here goes nothing. <laughs> I think I hit it. Oh, that just that sounded so hard. Oh. Okay, let's go have a look. Damage. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, that looks good. Come look, yeah. Ooh. Oh, an epic like Opie Slow Man. It's gonna look epic. Just have a look, yeah. Just look there. That is properly, properly ouchied. That's been, that's been hurt. Okay. I don't want to get, I don't want to get glass stuck in my hand now. I didn't think this one through. <laughs> I 
I think I'm gonna get a tiny shot of glass in my hand. Fuck me for Natal. Take the phone out. Look. Completely look at that little, little leather casing at the back. Oh, it went in right up until here. You can still find some shards of glass. I'm scared I break it. Take out the take out the pure field point. Huh. Oh, looky there. That Anna. That looks. I've never seen that. Oh, getting shots of glass in my hand. Okay, let's have another crack at it with the broad at 20. Now we're gonna verse this uh, little big old thing. I think this is probably an inch and a half long. And uh, yeah, it's it deadly. It's the thing you saw with the rubber band video as well. Versus uh, Monsieur cell phone. As you guys can see, the carnage has been wreaked. And I wanna hit it here. So I'm gonna try off 20. We'll see. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm quite excited. This looks majestic. I mean, if you look at this, it looks like those Hollywood scenes where they shot the bullet through the window. I think it looks like that. But uh, it, it didn't shatter as much as I thought it would because of this protective layer it has on you. And um, as badly as I want to take it off, I know I shouldn't. Because if I do, I'm gonna get glass everywhere in the grass. And that is going to suck. So I'm not gonna do that. But uh, anyway. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Setting up them cameras. Okay, yeah, that is. That is a. Uh, that is good. That is good. Okay, let's have at it. I set my pin to 20 yards. As you guys can see, the broadhead has been put on there. Lined it up and everything. There we go. There's the lethal setup. If you guys have made it this far in the video, thanks for watching. And um, please leave a like down below. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, remember to subscribe so that I can do more of these kind of dumb things. I rather enjoy shooting phones. Anyway, let's have at it. The, the phone's off. I think I... Uh, right. I think the phone fell off, so... I think I nudged that. No. Oh. Damn. <laughs> I nudged it. I hit it right at the bottom. Yo, look at the carnage. Wowza. That is hectic. That is hectic. I nudged it and I hit the cover quite quite square. So it's, it's shooting a little bit lower than expected. So let's have another go at it. Phone versus big broaded take three. Still at 20 yards. And uh, let's smash it in the face. So, you know, you see this, um, I don't think this phone is going to be the same anymore. I, re I was aiming here, so I did hit a bit right. But, um, yeah, I think it's safe to say this phone is done for it. Let's pull it out and see what, what the carnage. Okay. Oh. Oh, that camera's never taking a photo again. Oh. You look, I hit it square on the camera. That's epic. Oh, I don't poke my phone. You 
You, 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 you. Ouchie. Okay, let's get, let's get the arrow off. Moment of truth. I just want to be careful with it, not to break it even more and break my arrow. Okay, so, if you guys ever wondered how it looked inside a camera of a phone, there's absolutely nothing there. Like, you guys can see, I don't know what these companies are all going on about. I mean, there's the camera. There's nothing in there. I don't know how it works. It's magic. But, um, I'm not making a call on this thing. Oh, you can see the different layers of glass. I don't know if that's going to show. <laughs> I'm washing. That the broaded one looks the most epic, not going to lie. Anyway, yeah. Okay. That, that, that removed itself now. But, um, yeah. That brings us to the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I thoroughly enjoyed bashing in this phone. As, as you guys can see, the camera fell out totally. So, uh, yeah, it was very fun. It was very fun. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you made it this far in the video, thanks for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe down below. The things would be down below. Um, I don't think I'll be calling the oven again on this phone very soon. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Okay, guys, so post-production, I finished the video. And um, I shot it without the screen guard on there. I don't know what that silver piece is. Some kind of mirror? I'm no expert. But I mean, look at the back here. There's even some uh, some phone there. And there and there. And there. There's all the other charts. And yo, this is never going to be the same. Don't think I can hear. This thing's not. Yo, 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 yo. There you can see the silver part now. Wow. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you guys on the next one.